die before I got to him. I might get some answers. Hey! Why? Why Rodrigo Bronco? Why? What? Why did you come to kill Rodrigo Bronco? We came to kill you! Because what you did to us! You killed so many of us! What reason did this poor bastard have to lie? He would be dead from shock or loss of blood in half an hour, even if I didn't leave him there to burn. Uh, uh. Where's Fabiana? What? Fabiana Bronco, where is she? I don't want to sombra got her. Up the hill. Then it was up the hill for me, I guess, where the gang held sway. I had to try to figure out who was using these angry paramilitary clowns as some kind of front to kill Rodrigo. Rodrigo Bronco was dead. Fabiana was held hostage. I had no idea who was behind any of this. I felt like a fool. I was a sweaty, gray-haired mess. This place, well, this place was gonna kill me too. I could see that now. I decided that I was gonna die sober, not drunk. Ah! At least then I would see who shot me. It was time to take back control from whoever was out to get me. And if I didn't flush them out, at least my midlife crisis would confuse them enough so they did something stupid. It was the only hope I had. I knew I wasn't thinking straight. I'd been drinking and popping painkillers for years. I had a liver like a French goose and skin like red leather. Well, it wasn't perfect. In fact, it wasn't much good at all, but it was gonna have to do. At least I was facing in the right direction. Tá ligando, hein? Alô? Alô, Victor. Max? Max, you're, you're, you're alive? Of course I'm alive. We did not know this. We are lost, Max. Our brother was everything to us. I understand. Listen, I'm, I'm sorry about your loss. Both of you. Rodrigo was a good man. I failed him. I, but I was tricked. What happened, Max? I don't know. Some guys from the crush of Prado came into the building downstairs, so while me and the security guard were dealing with them, an assassin must have come in and executed your brother. I, at least that's how I think it happened. No, you killed him, Poha. You killed my brother. What are you talking about? I, I understand you're upset, but please, why the hell would I do that? To get his money, to take his money. How am I getting his money, Marcelo? Please, think. I worked my ass off for your family. I saved your life twice, or more. And right now, I'm going to get Fabiana. Where is she? Where is Fabiana, eh? She's in a place called Nova Esperanza. How do you know this, Max? One of the crotch of Prado told me this before he died. Please, bring our sister-in-law back to us, Max. Our family is being torn apart. It 
So I guess I was finally about to go and experience the other side of Sao Paulo firsthand. The bit people try to ignore. The unpleasant memory they try to obliterate with cocktails and helicopters and parties and lines of blow, like rich fools the world over. I was a day off the sauce for the first time in years and knew I was due a hangover sent direct from Mother Nature. I had no idea where the hell I was going to go, so I decided to head straight for the street party that seemed to be raging. Either that or some other fool had gotten there before me and now was being ritually sacrificed. I've had better ideas. But then I've also had worse ones, like accepting this job in the first place. E aí, gringo? You lost, kid. Eu me amarro nos States. Você precisa de ajuda, senhor? Speak English? Uh huh. Falo sim, sem problema. I need to know if you've ever seen this girl, Fabiana. Come here for a second. Look at her. I know lots of girls. Sexy. Come on, come on. This way. Where are you going? Wait a minute. Down there? É <laughs> isso. Jesus. This way, come on. At least I had found myself a tour guide. The way I see it, there's two types of people. Those who spend their lives trying to build a future, and those who spend their lives trying to rebuild the past. For too long, I've been stuck in between. Hidden in the dark. What was I really doing walking in there with my bad haircut and ridiculous shirt? Was I there to make something right? Or was I just using a messed up situation to indulge myself? Grasping at some desperate delusion of control. Maybe the two went hand in hand more than I cared to admit. I had stumbled into some kind of street party. This was the kind of reality Americans paid top dollar to see. Slums had become tourist attractions, places where yuppies could gawk at the endless spirit of the poor from the inside of their bulletproof buses. I felt dumb and exposed. I missed the booze. Not that it mattered, sober or drunk, I was hardly undercover. I stood out in this place like a streetwalker in a monastery. <laughs> What do you need, guys? What do you need? What are you doing here? I'm asking you. I called you here, bro. Easy, pal. Easy. Ah, então. Você é americano de merda. Look, I didn't mean any offense. Me dá só uma razão para eu não te matar, seu americano burro. Desculpa, amigo. Por favor. Passa tudo que você tem, viado. Pega o dinheiro dele. Pega o dinheiro dele. Ah, é lojão, hein? Passa aqui. Anda logo. Tá logo, da puta. Valeu, mano. Bem-vindo à favela Nova Esperança. All things considered, I was gonna have to look on this as a good outcome. I was deep in gang territory. These kids were raised hating clowns like me. Middle-income ass kickers who protected the rich by shooting kids like them. First day off the sauce and somehow I'd still ended up in the gutter. <laughs> <laughs>